Yo, this your boy Jive Turkey live from the two, one, mother fucking five. What up? I said, what up? What up? What's going on, y'all? Chilling, chilling, chilling. <sighs> so a lot of news came out about Call of Duty Modern Warfare 4 or the next Call of Duty. Even if they're going to call it Modern Warfare 4 or whatever it's called, as long as it's a modern boots on the ground game with no pink hair and mohawks and 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 armor, red armor and colorful guns, as long as it's just a standard, a standard Call of Duty. Watch how much numbers it's going to do because it's just a regular Call of Duty. And they're bringing out rumors like, yo, it's gonna come with Modern Warfare 3 and Modern Warfare 2 remastered. Like, I don't care about remastered video games. I'm just happy that it's not coming out with a battle royale. Let Blackout be Blackout and keep updating that. That's fine. That's fine with me. I don't care for battle royale. I don't care for Blackout. I don't care for a modern warfare too battle royale. I don't care for none of that shit. Just let us have Call of Duty the way it used to be. And it's crazy because we used to be like, oh my God, and this and the lag and the, we used to complain about the little things. And now look at how we want regular Call of Duty. That was a good shot by that guy. Look how we want regular Call of Duty back. Yes, this was the last good Call of Duty in my eyes. Some people think Ghost is good and hey, if you think Ghost is good, that's cool, you know, that's cool. It's boots on the ground though. All this stupid uh, specialist stuff, I, I, I really wanna know. I really just wanna know what their target was and yes call of duty was always stupid stuff like that is gonna happen like what was their target i just want to know like do we want to please the kids like it's obvious that's what it is we want to please the kids and have colorful stuff in the game and kids are dumb and colorful stuff keeps their attention what happened to just running around shooting people if you suck you get fucked up and if you're good you do good if you suck and keep getting fucked up you're gonna get better at the game or just play another game i, I really don't understand if you guys realize how bad i used to be in modern warfare 2. i used to be so bad at Call of Duty. Then I started watching Fisticuff videos. Watching his videos, watching his little techniques. Then I just started getting better and better and better. I didn't need the death streaks. I didn't need Marty Dome or whatever it's called. I didn't need any of that stuff. I just kept getting fucked up, learned from my mistakes, and got better. Just like you did. I didn't need uh, fucking specialist. Oh, oh yeah. I, I played a match for three minutes. So I get a rocket launcher or, or a grenade launcher that just, if it bounces near somebody, they're just going to die. I, I don't need that shit, man. Now, all of a sudden, hey, we're going to do a, a, a game type with, with no specialist, guys. Yay. Yeah. Play our game. No, no. We're not. We're not gonna play your game. Only a couple of us is gonna play your game, but not me. You know? I know Thunder loves Treyarch games and he he's just not gonna Well you, you, I don't blame guys like Thunder or whoever whoever's playing the the new games on like console because they can't really they gotta ho hook up a whole nother system. Like, I I understand that. Like, you got, you gotta hook up a whole 360 or a whole PS3 
just to play Black Ops 2. So I really understand that. This shit is at my fingertips. I could just install it, uninstall it on my PC and play. So I don't blame people who are still playing like Black Ops 4 on PlayStation 4 because I'm sure Ghost is dead. I'm sure I, I know nobody wants to play fucking those boost jumping games. It, it was a bad experiment by Call of Duty to run three years of boost jumping. I know after the first year they wanted to bail out of that boost jumping shit, but they couldn't because they're developing another boost jumping game while this boost jumping game is failing, you know? So they're developing two other boost jumping games at the same time while one of them is failing, which is Advanced Warfare, and then, uh, you know, Black Ops 3 come out and then they're like, Okay, it was lagging, guys. This, this shit was lagging, if y'all didn't know. Black Ops 3 was coming out. So, Black Ops 3 did better than Advanced Warfare. Of course it will because of the Treyarch Dick Riders. And it was a better game. I, I have to be truthful. It was a better game. But some people just think Treyarch can, can't do anything wrong. So, he's done. They bought the Treyarch game. Boom, boom. So it did better. So they're like, hey, you know what? We can just do our other boost jumping game, Advanced Warfare. Then that just super flopped. Super flopped. And then they said, fuck it. You know, like, let's go back to boots on the ground because the numbers, the numbers don't lie. The numbers do not lie, man. And they really thought that was going to be like a crazy trend that boost jumping stupid shit because of Weston Zampella. They said, yo, we're going to come out with this game, Titanfall and this. So COD, you know, they, they're dick riding asses, always copying off people's shit. Oh, we're going to make boost jumping games. Boom. It flopped. That boost jumping shit. Nobody likes. Halo was the only one that really did those numbers. And then now Halo can't buy a player base. It's done. It's done. It's done. Damn. It's done. I, I sound like a fucking mad old fucking man. And remember, Michael Jordan is the Jive Turkey of basketball. I'm out. I'm out.